Should there be recording. All right, smoking fish. Think so. Yeah. Thank you for coming this afternoon. <laughs> Thank you for coming this afternoon. Thank you for coming. Thank you for coming. <laughs> Thank you for all being here. It doesn't sound the same in Schlinget. <laughs> Thank you, thank you, Hati Adi, Kukachuhan. Thank you all for coming and being a part of our salmon program. And so we got lots of wonderful things to do today, and we're going to have to quickly get into it because we only have very limited hours here. So I would like to have Darren uh, Snyder please join me and search. All of our beneficiaries that have come here to help make this happen, if you can please come over this way. Tommy, Pabu, uh, we will be. As a matter of fact, I love him how this kid is thinking. He's like, hey, I remember last Salmon Project. You guys were here all night. Are you going to be here all night? <laughs> so that's awesome. Yes, we are going to be here all night. But, again, this is the opportunity for everybody to experience and come when needed. Hold on, hold on, James. So it'll be a time for um, everyone to hop in any time that they want throughout the process from today all the way until Sunday evening, 4 p.m. So first, we need to do our welcomes. <laughs> Hi, welcome. I apologize for uh, uh, not arriving uh, before you. Uh, we have been busy all morning, but I forgot the hose. <laughs> so I went and ran to get the hose. Um, so heen or water is exceptionally important in our all of our activities day to day. Um, but uh, part of our, our whole fish camp experience is to make sure that we're doing it right. And part of that is to make sure to clean the right things at the right time and uh, make sure that we're uh, uh, going through all the important steps and the processes along the way. Uh, so my name is Darren Snyder. It's lovely to see many familiar faces and uh, many friends from from uh, uh, many different areas. Um, Ivan, I hope that your your garden is growing well, and I look forward to seeing it. Yeah, awesome. And uh, so uh, we um, have. A number of things. I hope that um, that you saw my email from um, uh, at some point. It's okay if you didn't, but uh, I did send out an email that kind of explained um, a little bit, uh, which is essentially uh, we're hoping to uh, have this be an all hands on deck, ready for action, and just do what you can kind of experience for all of us. Um, uh, we, we have done a lot of front loading, but there's still going to be a lot to do, and that's I think part of what. Um, what I think of as a fish camp that you know, embodies is doing things together and working together, learning together, learning from each our own mistakes and each other's mistakes and uh, improving along the way. And so this is a safe place uh, for us all to make mistakes and for us all to uh, learn together. Uh, I'm very passionate about this. I, uh, I love to grow food and I love to grow community and I just thank you all for being here. Uh, please do. Um, uh, chime in uh, as as and, and, and step up as, as ever um, you see fit. Um, we do have uh, our access to the hall here. Um, we're going to be um, limited in our time frames uh, in that they're going to start the bingo activity at 5:30, so we do need to be out of there by five. Um, and uh, but we have a whole array of things to go to, to be doing. Uh, what 
I, I would like to um, uh, refrain from talking too much because that's kind of what I do. And, um, and uh, I'd, I'd like to make sure that, uh, that, uh, that we have an opportunity to uh, hear from uh, Dr. Dane, uh, Tommy, Jimmy Jr., and uh, to maybe kind of share with us a little bit about whatever you'd like to share with us. <laughs> It's really good to see all of you on this. I didn't uh, expect to see such a great turnout, but it's really great to see all of you. I'm glad you all came. Uh, they, they, they regard me as an elder. I don't know why they do that. But, uh, so I'm, I'm the historian and the storyteller. And I'll be sharing a little bit about, uh, you know, how all of this relates to our story and our history and that kind of thing as we go along. So, Dach Kodain Yuchetu Wasaf is, that, that's my name, I'm Dach Kodain. And uh, I, I don't want anybody to use my English name, just call me Dach Kodain. Can you say that? Yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you. I think we can take our masks off. On, I promise. <laughs> if, if I hear you. And that's another one too, you know, um, as we're elders and so forth, you know, he's not trying to be disrespectful or anything, but sometimes you just got to speak a little louder for our elders to let them know that you're you're talking with them. So again, Ganesh, thank you for being here. We also have people from um, CCTHITA or that are um, resource leaders. Hi everyone. Is the camera still on? about the light in the front. No. The light's not on. Mm -hmm. Do you want to turn it back on? <laughs> well, hold on. Okay. Take it off and let me see it. The whole thing with the headpiece on. salmon before? Never. Hold your hand up. Or no, don't hold your hand. If you can help, help our, our families be safe with uh, filleting, that is, you know, again, we're all working together as a community. Our organizations are working as a community. And we hope to be just like this beautiful forest. All the diverse people that are here our roots all um, joining in together. So again, Benafchish, and then for those that um, that are familiar with pressure cooking, Kinday Jin, anyone familiar with kin pressure cooking? Oh, yuck egg, yuck egg. Okay, so we got some experience here. We're gonna still go through from beginning to the, from, you know, no experience to the fully experienced. And the ones that are experienced, you know, please share your knowledge. You know, there, there might be an opportunity to say or share something about your experience. Um, an example would be for me, and I use this with gardening. I thought for sure when I planted one little radish seed that I was gonna pull up a bundle. And I only came up with one. I was like, what the heck, <laughs> you know? So again, from your experiences, I share this story with a lot of children when I'm doing um, gardening. So that again they get that instant um, knowledge so how do we want to break up yeah okay so um, uh, I just wanted to also let you know that uh, what Hannah was talking about um, uh, uh, we have an example of this uh, where uh, with baby greens or a uh, uh, you can grow your own uh, salad uh, throughout the winter and so um, we have an example of that that I don't know if we've moved it into the hall yet 
uh, but it was right over here because they were using the hull previously. Uh, but we, so you can see what we're talking about, light racks and such. And so this is that's going to be something that hopefully you're excited about um, us being able to help you out with. Um, fortunately, Search has uh, um, money for doing healthy activities, and they uh, were able to purchase this fish for us, and we've been scrambling to get it. Um, I'll tell you more about that later. Um, but uh, um, but uh, it's uh, that's part of the projects that we're going to be doing um, over the winter. Um, so um, I want you to uh, to uh, to understand uh, the process here that as we as we uh, pro as we cut up the fish, um, some of the fish is going to be in fillets already. Some of it is going to be uh, um, they call it. Uh, uh, H and G, headed and gutted, so they don't have the heads, but they do have the tails, and so those will be the ones that we're filleting. Um, so the first ones are coho, the second ones are kita or chum or dog, and um, and so which are all wonderful for smoking. They're perfect for this uh, what we're doing. Um, I do want to um, acknowledge that just with any like any kind of cooking thing that uh, we should uh, we should. Uh, Make sure our hands are clean. I have some sterilizer. There's also bathrooms inside. If you go in the main doors, they should still be unlocked. If they're not, then I've got the key for us. Um, and then the bathrooms are in the main doors to the right. And so if you ever need to use the restrooms and wash your hands and such, that's where we have that available. Uh, but otherwise, um, we're going to be cutting up the fish. And uh, one of the ways they'll work is that we have these, um, we're going to have these runners here. We're going to cut them to size so that um, you can put the fish on here and it doesn't slip all over the place. And, uh, and you can also cut into this, uh, this carpet runner without uh, worrying about uh, hitting the table too much. And it's our work table, so uh, but we don't need to carve them up uh, for no reason. Um, and uh, uh, we'll do a final wipe, uh, a, quick, a quick wipe down before we uh, start using them, just make sure there's no dirt on them. But rest assured that uh, after we go through the smoking process and then the canning process, uh, those are the canning process is what's called the kill step. That's when we're sure that all the germs and bacteria um, have been killed off. So we don't need to be too, too concerned like uh, uh, I think you're going to be licking the table or something. It's going to be it's going to be killed during the canning process. Um, so um, we uh, um, we uh, I'm going to. Uh, Ask for some help, and, and we're in, in a number of ways. Um, and uh, one uh, is that uh, and we, we can just kind of ha uh, we have uh, some wood in here. Already done. Yeah, I like it. All right. Um, what, um, another thing is um, yeah. <laughs> another thing is that we've got um, team early birds. Uh, uh, unless somebody <laughs> snuck into my minivan here, we do have a hose that needs to get uh, connected to a bib on the other side of the building. And we got a little chuck on that. I don't know if anybody can help take care of that. Anyone, anyone, anyone? You like the hose person? Hoser. Give me the hoser. <laughs> so, so um, thank you. Uh, and so uh, I'll, I'll get you that. And then um, there are, uh, there'll be a couple other things to grab out of there, um, including the, um, the fillets. And so um, I think that it's a good idea. Maybe we'll start with the fillets and we'll start to, to cut them into the strips because um, that's the. Uh, one of the techniques that we're going to use today is that we're going to cut these uh, fillets into strips and uh, and then tie them with strings and hang them. And uh, and uh, so that's going to be what's going to be happening in the smoker. Uh, and so we'll, uh, we'll we'll show you how to do that. We've got lots of knives. Uh, you'll cut them into cut them into strips, and then we'll have um, our stainless steel bowls. Uh, which you'll put them into, and that's where we're going to do what's called the brine. We're going to, uh, it's salt, sugar, um, uh, there are various types of brines that we do, um, uh, which, and that we can do, um, and, uh, um, and, then, uh, and then after they've set in the brine for a little while, that's when, after which we'll rinse them off and then, and then hang them. So, um, so before we, we all leave and get to work, there's one thing in our culture as uh, Tlingit people, when we harvest, when we preserve and so forth, our attitude. Mm -hmm. Our attitude has to be with gratitude. And this is who helped me with that. And again, 
um, science are doing studies now. You're seeing it live, how they treat animals, how they do all these things. It is from our teachings, how we would harvest an animal. It was very important because, again, it nurtures our body. And you will see all these scientific studies today. Oh, talking to the plants, it's going to grow beautiful and make all these wonderful fruits and everything's going to be, you know, put into your body. So again, when harvesting, when preserving this beautiful food that we're going to be um, working with, attitude of gratitude, that salmon, how it got here, those fishermen who, who worked hard to bring it here, and now here we are with our families. This is how it was done a long time ago too. When the salmon came in, we all did it as a big community. So again, gonna cheese, gonna cheese. Do you like to share anything with that? Or did I do okay? Oh good. I'm an apprentice under this uh, under this elder, so again it's very important for me to make sure that he um, he makes sure that I'm I'm doing things correctly as well too. So gonna cheese. Can we ask for introductions um, for Katie and Katie to introduce yourself to the family members? Um, right here. I'm John. Hello, I'm Kathleen. That A is my husband's name, and this is my son. Jan. You're all grown up. Sister program, and this is my little brother Ben. Yeah, hey, thank you for bringing Ben. Oh, Hi, I'm Ashley. I'm a plus one. Yes, hey, <laughs> cheese. Thank you for coming. Uh, and this is. Yeah. My name is Ivan. Uh, I know a little about little about gardening, but I could use a lot 